Good afternoon. I'm Kim Baez. That firebug may have cost a small business owner in Valencia County tens of thousands of dollars. And they aren't the only ones who've been hit. News 13's Cole Miller is live in the newsplex with the story and what the family's saying. Kim, this fire has taken a huge toll on the Los Chavez business. As investigators continue looking for answers, the family is trying to rebuild. Early Monday morning, smoke pours from this barn in Los Chavez. It was very, very involved. It was an intense fire. A blaze that took firefighters from across Valencia County almost eight hours to get under control. He had about 2,000 bales of hay, of older hay, that was in a, this hay barn right here behind us. Carrying a price tag of about $10,000, that hay is now destroyed. Carolyn Mendoza says the hay loss isn't the toughest part. Her father, Toby Cordova, owns Toby's Doors just off of New Mexico 314 south of Los Lunas, and the business is affected too. He's worked his whole life for this, and he's been here 40 years, and to see some of this go up in smoke is, is tough. Mendoza guesses at least a thousand metal doors, which were laying near the barn, were also lost in Monday's fire. It's devastating. Um, we, you know, got a lot of orders yesterday that we can't fulfill anymore, and so it's, you know, our business has stopped um, in a certain, to a certain degree. The family is trying to figure out how this all happened, and they can't help but think a fire bug is to blame. We had an incident um, back in June that we actually caught on our surveillance cameras. Surveillance images show two shadowy figures on the property. On on June 16th, when someone set fire to a set of pallets near the road. Valencia County Fire Chief Stephen Gonzalez says they have investigated a series of suspicious fires in the Los Chavez area over the last few months. Everything from trailers and sheds to dumpsters and a car. In this case, they haven't ruled anything out. Usually hay fires in our area are usually sp spontaneous combustion. Um, there has been question about an arson bug running around in the Los Chavez area, however unconfirmed at this time. Mendoza says they're still adding up the costs, worried that if there is a fire bug, where will the suspect or suspects strike next? You know, hopefully, if it was someone that came to do this intentionally, that they'll be caught and people have their eyes open and, you know, their ears open. Unfortunately, the family has been in this situation before. They lost everything in an accidental fire back in 1994. Chief Gonzalez says had crews arrived at Monday's fire scene just 15 to 20 minutes later, the whole business would have gone up in flames again. Kim, back to you. Okay, thanks, Cole. Now, the Valencia County Fire Marshal is continuing to investigate this case and the other suspicious fires. No suspects have been identified.